Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing really good. So today's video is another clean with me. I absolutely love filming these videos and I really enjoy watching them. So I thought I would do a power hour with you. I'm starting off in our bedroom, making sure the bed's made and looking all nice again. I cannot do it with an unmade bed. It drives me insane. So I'm getting that done first because then I can have a clear mind to get everything else done. If you aren't subscribed to my channel, I would love you to hit subscribe and stick around for more videos. I usually post twice a week and it's all motherhood, lifestyle, fashion, cleaning, food, all sorts of different things. So I would love to have you as a subscriber. I really hope this video motivates you to get your clean on and to get things done in an hour. I set my timer and it just helps me so much more to get things done when I set a timer and I know that I've got a small amount of time to get it done and it needs to be done so I'm just going to clean off the bedside tables and just give them a wipe down with some Zaflora. I absolutely love Zaflora. Any kind of Zaflora scent is really nice but I love fresh linen. That's probably my favourite, especially for like bedrooms and stuff. We've recently redecorated our bedroom um, from moving into the house, so I'm really excited to show you guys what it looks like. We've just got a few more little finishing touches to do, and then I can show you a little room tour if you'd like. Let me know in the comments if that's something you'd be interested in seeing. I absolutely love spraying Febreze in the bedroom when I'm cleaning because it makes the room smell so lovely and clean and it's a vanilla scent as well so it's absolutely gorgeous. I'm just emptying the bin as well because that always ends up full all the time because I'm putting my contact lenses in there and everything else and it just ends up really full. Um, and then I'm going around the room and giving it a quick vac. Um, this vacuum isn't my favourite honestly. Um, it's a shark cordless and I'm just not impressed. I don't know, I just don't get on with it the state of the boys room constant mess i've been clearing out the spare room and because of that there was some toys still in there so i've had to bring everything in here and i'm trying to sort through it all and oh honestly toys just the bane of my life i'm constantly tidying toys away but i love it i love it when they play so much but honestly there is so many toys far too many toys for two little boys Now I'm just folding some of Alfie's pyjamas and popping them back under his pillow. He always throws them like when he takes them off and gets dressed for school in the morning. He just flings his pyjamas anywhere. Sometimes they end up on top of the bed like on the little um, wooden part at the top. He just throws them everywhere. So I'm just folding those up nice and neatly, popping them under his pillow and then I'm going to make his bed. I love making the boys beds. It just looks so lovely and neat in their room and tidy. I do this every single morning when they wake up. I'd like to get in there, tidy the bed, make the bed straight away, try and make them help me as well a little bit so they learn to make the beds. Um, and then I'm gonna go through some of these toys. I need to really sort through them and make a pile of things I can take to the charity shop that the boys don't play with anymore. We really need like a big clear out. I keep saying this and I've done a little bits and then new toys keep popping up that they've not played with for ages that they don't really use anymore so I need to have a serious clear out and give some to charity or to a hospital or somewhere that can make some good use of them. Oh and don't even get me started on soft toys like we have so many soft cuddly toys and I just don't know what to do with them so if anyone has any recommendations please let me know. I did end up popping them all in like a storage basket and trying to make them look all cute but honestly we have so many and I'll say to Alfie and we'll do like which ones do you like and whatever and should we get rid of this one I'm like no I really like that one I always play with that one and they never do they never play with soft toys 
never ever but some of them are special like some of them we've got from disney and things like that and some of them they've both had from being babies but yeah i'm trying to make it look kind of neat and just kind of cute but they are a bit a bit annoying out the soft toys anyone agree It's finally looking lovely and clean and tidy again. I'm just going to go around with the hoover now and just make sure that there's no mess on the floor. As usual, love carpet lines in this room. It always shows up really good. Then I'm just going to give our hallway a vac before I move on to the bathroom. I'm just using a surface cleaner to clean the sink. This is from Aldi. I really, really like this. It just does the job. It's good. It's affordable. Um, I'm just going to give the sink a good scrub. It always ends up filthy with toothpaste and everything else. So I'm just giving that a really good scrub and a wipe down with a microfiber cloth. And then I'm going to move on to the mirror and then on to the bath. Then the last couple of things I got done in this power hour were some ironing that needed doing and then I also just put some washing in the dryer but I really hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that it inspired you to get whatever you needed to get done in an hour and see if you could set yourself a little timer to see how much you could get done. It definitely helps me to get so much more done when I set myself a timer. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!